doing today so um i will be going over this um eye mask so it's basically gold snail hydrogel eye patch uh, mos it moisturizes nut uh, nutrition and nutrition snail secretion filtrate so honestly speaking i was a little bit hesitant to buy this however i still bought it i never use anything that has nail uh secretion in it um normally a lot of, nowadays a lot of them really just say it and they're not really those stuff um as you can i'm not i, I believe this may be korean product but i'm not exactly 100 percent sure um but it has 60 sheets in it so um i got this from tj maxx i never heard of this company before um tj maxx marshall's um they're pretty good when it comes to in terms of different products that you may have not heard about in the skincare department of theirs um and this right here don't worry about it uh i already opened it myself so before anybody says that it's already broken this is their security alarm so hence why that's right there so, um, okay, yeah. So, um, I patch, uh, is a soft hydrogel type of excellent moisturizing nutrition. When attached to skin, it will provide, provide elasticity to tired eyes. Um, my eyes don't really look that tired, um, even though I don't really sleep the mask should be um it's more of like the dark circles um various ingredients including gold okay i don't know again the gold part i am a little bit sketchy about oh i actually got from marshall's not tj maxx my bad guys it's eight dollars and it's compared and comparing it at 15 so that means it is originally for 15. so the gold part uh, i'm a bit sketchy so that's why it, i end up being a little bit sketchy about the snail secretion filtrate it has hydrolyzed collagen uh pen pentanol help to skin around uh around eyes make elastic so arrange your uh, skin around your eyes by using tonic after washing your face please take an eye patch out with the enclosed spoon a spatula and put it into the part that you want on your face Take them off the eye patch after 10 to 20 minutes and massage in the remaining of your skin. So I haven't really opened it yet. I just cut it out. So let's see how it looks. Oh, what? Okay, so let's take this because normally they're all already separated. Um, just give me a second, guys. I'll be back. Open it. This is how it looks like. So this is the spatula they were talking about, guys. So and I'll be back after trying to open this top part up so give me a second guys this is how it looks like um, so those are the typical gels so I'm assuming they want you to push out like this so um, they are golden in color obviously I think they don't want you to touch your hands just in case you know for the most part you will be saying it with your hands anyways but um, I thought there was going to be like a separate for like the liquid and that you have to point your face and then put the patch on top but it is what it is i'll come back and let you know how i hydrate my skin feels normally one thing i will let you guys know is that um i always say uh two things one is that not everybody's skin type is the same so not everybody will have the same um results um skincare for everybody is different uh just because something may work for me may not necessarily mean it will work for you and vice versa um second thing is that um if you ever see my lip mask videos i always mention that i'm not you don't necessarily need a lip mask if you're really hydrated so for the most part your lips will be hydrated and that's how i am i drink a lot of water um so for the most part i normally do lip masks um when I have to go out, I'll quickly do like a lip mask beforehand. And I've been using like uh, the lip, um, like the, I have the lip oil and then like, you know, like um, lip balms anyways. Um, but I really use them, but still I, I use them. Now, 
As far as the eye mask is concerned, they are slightly different different to what I would say with the lip mask. Yes, your skin will be hydrated with drinking a lot of water. Um, if you're one of them who just started drinking a lot of water and you really don't drink enough of water, first the water will make your internal organs hydrated first before it can come and show up uh, and have results on your skin. Normally, yes, when you're drinking a lot of water, it will eventually show up on your skin, especially under your eyes. Which helps out a lot with the collagen, well, to a certain extent with the collagen. However, um, since we, when it comes to moisturizing and stuff like that, we don't really pay much attention to under the eyes. Unless if you're one of those who has a skincare routine that includes um, eye, eye cream. Um, even then, we normally don't use eye mask. So in that sense, yes, it will hydrate your skin. So with this... Um, it's 100% recommended if your under eyes does need hydration. So I'll go ahead, put it on, and leave it on for like, how long do I have to leave it on for? Like 10 to 20 minutes. And then I'll come back and let you guys know how I feel about it. So stay tuned. Back. And they asked me, okay, so I actually didn't realize how dry my under eyes would be because it kind of absorbed a lot of it already. Uh, not a lot of it, like, for the most part, like, and it's pretty good. So, like, the hydration is there. Um, now, since I'm home, working from home, I can use it as often as I can. Obviously, not to overdo my hair, um, hair, my skin. I'm not going to put it on every single day. So, I didn't really feel like that there was, like, snail... Secretion, you know how when the snail moves, they, they have that thing that leaves behind? It didn't feel like that. It just felt like, you know, a typical mask, like the lip and face mask that they have. It just felt like, you know, there was some um, little liquid stuff, like all masks have. Korea is known for these um, snail ones, and supposedly it says that snail ones is pretty good for your skin. So right now... Uh, it kind of did hydrate my skin. It feels, I wouldn't say plump, but it feels pretty good. Um, hydrated, which is a plus, uh, which I like. Um, the whole point of hydrogel is basically to hydrate. Um, and it's a plus for me. I like it. So, um, I will definitely, definitely, definitely use it when um, I have to go to a special event and put it on before my makeup. It will definitely help out a lot with the makeup. And obviously, that's not the only time I will use it. I will use it, you know at least at least twice a week especially like i said i'm working from home right now if i am i'm not working from home obviously i will try to do it on the weekends or i should be doing it on the weekends because i have like a full jar um the witch should last me a while um it will be expiring okay i am confused it says 2023 here and then september 2006 um so I am assuming that this will expire sometime in 2023. So I have enough, more than enough time to actually use the whole thing. Um, so yeah. Um, so what you're going to do initially is obviously wash your face. Um, if you want to put this on and then the rest of your face, um, those peel offs. Um, not, uh, you can always do that. And then... Um, so what you can do is wash your face, have a toner, clean off your face, put this on, and then the rest of the face you can just do a regular peel off. Um, the ones that you normally will wash off your face or just peel it off. Um, so like that you are able to do something to the rest of your face as well. And you should always wash your face before doing any kind of face mask, not just this. Um, face masks, eye masks, lip masks, um, whether that's the sheet mask or the other liquid ones that you apply. So like that, um, it helps your skin with, um, the masks will work a lot better on your face. Um. And even the foot masks, hand masks, whatever mask that you do, um, just wash the area and because it will be helpful, like you're getting rid of any um extra products like the dust, dirt, cleaning out pores. So it will help you helpful a lot more. I would personally would recommend this. I got this from Marshalls, like I mentioned. Um, so uh, you can definitely 
I would have to check if they have a website, but I definitely got this from Marshalls. So other than that, I will be linking both my Instagram pages down below. Make sure to follow them, hit the subscribe button, the bell button, and I'll be back for more. Stay safe and stay tuned, guys.